So now, ito na yung produkto. First screening. So private yon Kayo-kayo lang muna yun. Diba? Did you invite the actors to, to watch it? No. I think, yeah. I think yung, yung official screening. Pero yeah. kayo, noong una, sino ba una? Kayo lang muna ni na Chloe ang nanood. Yeah, oo. Just the two of you, kasama si Nahela, kasama si Naana, kasama no, si No, kami Naandra. lang, I think kami lang muna ni ni Chloe and the editor. Oo. Who scored? The who music? Oh, I made sure that like uh, German artists, there was an American artist and I also made sure na may Filipino artists on okay. board. Yeah. So now, eto na, pinapanood niyo na yung movie. Mm-hmm. How did it resonate with you? Knowing full well, it's not in your vernacular. It's, uh, it's in a different language. Yeah. Tapos, this is not your first film, but for some reason, ito pala yung, ito pala yung mag, magpapagreen light na, oh, everybody, look at Diane. Ito yung, <laughs> what was going through your head nung pinanood mo na to for the first time? For the first time, there was still a lot of like, um, excitement and innocence I would say like I didn't really think about like the technical aspects of things I was just like in awe like oh my god we finished the project I'm so proud of myself <laughs> that's it I'm so proud of us that we actually even you know saw this through the end so that was my first thought but of course going you know Chloe Konyare, like she bihasana yan sa, sa film, film industry yeah. so what she saw uh, were mistakes and not really, you know. It's, right. Uh, you know. Kumbaga siya, parang, ah, okay, okay, yes, we ito did. Ito dapat yeah. pwede mong ayusin to na ganyan, yeah. ganyan, ganyan. And then, we took on that approach. So every time we would watch the film in the editing room, we would find mistakes. And it was so, it's so difficult also to assume this kind of like, you yeah. know, perspective. Kasi, that bilok, you, yes, kasi mm. bilok sa mo yung reticular. Once, once sa kabukas na yun, once pinoint out na ni Chloe sa yun, tuwing dadaan doon, nakikita mo na eh. Mm, mm, mm. Tsaka tuloy-tuloy na yan, like, okay, what are the mistakes that we could fix? Right. So, it was not appreciating anymore. <laughs> it was more like criticizing your own work. And then, then it gets to a point. And I'm sure, like, you know, I was talking to Audrey before that it's the same yeah. with, with music, music. When you yes. when you master and you listen to yes. it over and over, there comes a point where, like, I cannot watch this anymore. Mm. I hate this. Diba? Tapos, yeah. when is enough enough? Diba? Parang, yeah, yeah. Well, parang and so, like, I also read somewhere, I don't know if, if I'm quoting right, or if, if it's even the right person, like David Fincher said, like, I, the movie is, a movie is never finished. You just, yeah. like, you know, you just have to kind of sort of move on. I'm sure that's not the exact word, but, yeah, that's Again, precisely it. keep moving it. forward, diba? Yeah, because diba you just have to put a deadline to it. Otherwise, it would be forever. You will never be satisfied you yep. know, I, I hope there is one day where I'm like, okay, this is it, you know. But until, you know, you're always, even when I watch it now, like, ah, I should have done this instead or maybe we could do it a different way. Pero hindi ka naman apologetic by saying, na, oh, panuwari mo to, pero ano, wag mo titignan itong part na to kasi itong part na to medyo may mali ako dito, ganyan. You just keep it to yourself, right? Um... No, sometimes I'm very like open about my <laughs> vulnerabilities when I tell them like this is my first official feature, so please don't judge, you know, based on don't, don't be so harsh or or just keep an open mind when you watch this film. Like get, try to give it a chance and not, because I know how critical I am of my own work. So maybe that also helps because whatever criticism I get from other people, it's like, yeah, I've heard that, but worse from myself. Now guess what? Mm-hmm. Excited. As si Chloe rained on your parade. She was just being prag- <laughs> pragmatic she was about doing it. Her job. Do, do, doing her job. So I only come from being to being. And then now, the next step, it has to be showcased. Yeah. So what were you like going into different festivals, knowing full well na, oh shoot, having technical errors but then again a technical error has nothing to do with the story there, yeah, there yeah. are technical errors but what are emotion mo going through that ah super mixed emotions it, mo, wala pang award at this yeah. point ha? this is mm. zero award mm. so are, were you as excited as you thought you would be nung pinapasok mo na yung the thing was the very first festival where we premiered the film was at Hofer Film okay. Tage, and it was one of the most prestigious 
festivals in Germany. So, kumbaga parang Sundance nila right. doon yun. And alam mo na kagad yung mga uh, pinoint out ni Chloe sa'yo. So, dalag yeah. na lang na ngayon yun. Yeah, diba? so it was a mixture of like, oh, you know, like trepidation. Like, should I show this to these <laughs> people who, you know, who are used to watching like these these great films? Exactly. Like, because that that film festival, they discovered um, Vem Vendors, for example. Ooh. And and like the big, um, you know, the big yeah. director. So, to be just, you know, like, just part of something that was that big was like already you such a... You na, parang top board na for, for that Oh, moment, so yeah. parang, wow, I, I, I'm even part of it. So that w- there was excitement and thrill of it, but at the same time, yun nga na parang doubts also like, am, you know, am I worthy to even be part of this? But just at the same time, I was also happy because my the act, some of my actors, actually the, the lead, like Nyamandi, this was his first film the one opposite oh. Carl uh, Yannick. So, so for me, like for him to have that platform and that premiere was special to him. And it was, they give me the confidence. Now, were, was it the first time for Sina Yannick to see the movie at this festival? No, they've seen it okay. already before because Yannick also sort of co-produced the film. So What was his comment, si Yannick? Si Yannick, of course, was like super, he was, he's always very happy and he's also super grateful that that was the reason that um, we became friends because we became friends almost yeah. practically yeah. family after, yeah, after that. working yes. together. So, you know, uh, he was very supportive because he's big. He doesn't even need additional kind of, um, what, what do you call this? Promotional or... Uh, kumbaga, kumbaga, this, this was parang uh, labor of, parang passion din niya to, to do something and cross it out of his... Yeah, because he's a commer- he's yes. commercially successful. He does films for Paramount. He even does like you know some. So he does sinabing. supporting film for like a, a Hollywood film. So, parang you know. Parang mo sinabi siya na agamulak na ganon nag nag indie film para ganon. So that's that's how that's how it felt like. Pero yun nga, there's also that pride in like hey, he believed in this project enough to want to be part of something that was. Right. You know, that was, uh, you know, below his pay grade, <laughs> so, you know, so to speak. So, ito na, festival well, na. Mm-hmm. Pinapalabas na. Naririnig mo na yung reaction ng audience. Uh, mm-hmm. What was going through your head and in your heart? Um, I was just, you know, nervous. And But I think when I came out, I think a lot of people were surprised. First of all, that it was written by a woman and because it's about two adolescent people. Men. men and um yeah that it was i was not german i was filipina and so that's about what oh yeah they were like what? Yeah. <laughs> you know <laughs> like you know because some of them even cried on yes. you know in the film so it, it resonated with them and then for them to find out that it was a person that was not you know that that made the film touch them it was you know it was very kind of fulfilling so oh yun, yun yung mga reactions that uh, i mean of course there are also like yes. other you know negative reactions but this reaction like these kinds of reactions are what makes everything worth it na parang, yes. oh i was able to break that barrier of you know like um getting through people that are you know not our people but you know beyond borders beyond ginawa, borders yeah. oh and that was precisely the reason why i went into filmmaking in the first place to unite people through stor- storytelling and then kind of proving that despite all our differences that we are all essentially the same, yep. at least our emotional journeys. Yes. And so, and with that kind of reaction, it's, it's sort of like, kind of, you know, it... Galing. Yeah. Y- yun. So, tapos, ayan na. Did this win an award dito sa unang festival? It was a testament. Yun, sorry. Um... Th- for Hofer, they wanted to um, they wanted to um, nominate it actually, but they asked me, "Is it a German production?" And uh, that dun kami na disqualify because it was a Philippine yes. production. So ang dun kasi it's very yeah, it's it's, it's, it's a German it's, festival. May standards din sila, di ba? They have mm. to follow the qualifications and all that stuff. Yeah, also. so yung I mean, of course, they, they they were happy that they got the world premiere of the film, but it couldn't have been nominated because they, you know, it was yeah. a German festival. Yes. And they had to German. Uh, they they had to nominate uh, German produced films. Right. Mm-hmm. Pero positive, di ba? Promising yung ganon. Yeah. So finally, sinali mo na sa iba. Mm. When the first award came in, what was what was going through your head, Kay Chloe? Say mo na. Um. Do you still remember that? I forgot. It was the first one. 
uh, I don't know if it was ca- uh, in Spain or in Vegas, you know, I think best director or best feature. So it was already the biggest award. Yeah. And so I was like, yeah, I, I mean, I couldn't explain it. I was like, did they make a mistake? <laughs> <laughs> did they just call out my name? Yeah, so, uh, yeah, it was like, but of course we were happy uh, that it was, you know, recognized at least because it, uh, it was a sentiment that was shared by not only those that were working in the film, but c- it was a multinational, yes. you know, so everyone that was represented, representing the film also represented where they were from. So it was like a huge um, proud moment for all of us. Of course. And yeah. If, if if I may ask, is your mom and dad still around? My mom passed away. I'm sorry. Yeah, my dad, of course. Yeah, he's seen the film. Uh, but every time I make a film, like you know, you, they see in the credits, like it's for Mama. So Aww. you know, I it, it's always dedicated to her because she was the first person that ever believed in me. Of course, like I was young, I'd be like I want to be a writer, I want to be a director, and no one was like, eh, no, <laughs> that's not gonna happen, you know. But my mom was like, of course, no, you can do this. You ah, know, ga- gano ka gano ka importante yon yung yung pagbigay ng validation ng validation ng magulang sa anak. How how important I think was it, it for you? I think it was the most important, you know, opinion. I mean, she was the most important person, you know, back then. She still is, you know, it's very important. But at that time, you know, what she said was law. So <laughs> for me, so if she said something, if she supported me, Ooh. everything else was, you know, just Galing, noise, huh? you know. But if my mom said, I could do this, I will do it, you know. Are you like that to Eon? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes I, you know, because my dad was, you know, or, you know, there. Oh, it's y- like yeah, sila ng dalawa. Eh. Oh, oh yeah. na parang, okay, let's also be practical, you know. <laughs> so, so both those voices kind of come out with Eo, na parang, no, I want you to pursue your passions, but let's try to do it in a logical way, you know. Like, Ganun ka? Mm-mm, let's, let's try to also approach it in, in a way that but makes sense. But, Derek, you were not logical at 70. Yun nga eh. You were not logical <laughs> at uh, 15, uh, 31, mm-hmm. 32. Mm-hmm. Why? Why Why the sudden, was it, is it maternal instinct that you're protective of your son? Of course. And no, but it was also tried and tested that sometimes if you find a way, <laughs> there is a way. So try lang but to balance. But why don't logical? <laughs> In a logical way. No, because of course, you know, um, it's a difficult industry to navigate also, <laughs> diba? So Says you have to, to balance. <laughs> no, but if you follow your passions and you're good at it, which he is, yes. naman, it will make sense. Ito you na, know, na, it na, will et, make sense and et, it does make sense. It's a hard question. Mm. Kung nilagyan mo ng logic yung 16, 17-year-old Diane, would you have moved forward as fast as you thought you would? Hmm. I think the conviction made it logical. <laughs> <laughs>